How many pairs of lashes do you have on? Girl, I have no clue. As soon as they start getting <laughs> dusty, I just put another pair on top. <laughs> You're trippin'! What's the clue? Okay, let's read the clue. Maybe that'll give us some inspiration. Oh, becoming royalty. Oh. <laughs> is this for us? Are we not already? Do you think this is like Meghan Markle inspired? <laughs> Ooh! Such a rag Are we going story. to the royal wedding? <laughs> we're, we're getting styled for the royal wedding. That's what's happening right Actually, now. Actually, even if we're not going to the royal wedding. When which, is the royal wedding? It's like, it's like sometime soon. in this. It's very Coming soon. Up. What if we're about to be extras in Princess Diaries 3? Is it weird that I feel like that's less plausible? <laughs> it's odd that you and I don't have much knowledge of what it's like to be royal, <laughs> but it's hard for us to become inspired. It's also a Monday and my brain's just honestly not working that well, so I'm just gonna kind of stop guessing. Okay, well, if you had to choose between going to the royal wedding and being an extra in Princess Diaries 3, what would you choose? Oh, I would choose going to the Royal Wedding. Same. Okay, I'm really glad we're on the yeah. same page here. And I will say she already like had this in the bag because she already had, like, had a vague British accent, kind of like Madonna, before she was even with Prince I Harry. think you just made that up. <laughs> I might have, but it definitely, it all makes sense for me. Okay, what whatever. Saying. Let's go to the let's, wedding. Let's go! Time. <laughs> Wait, is Wait. that what we're doing today? I'm covered in goosebumps. You girls are about to get your faces beat for the gods. Oh. We are going to turn you lovely ladies into handsome women. Okay. Very I'm handsome so women. Just like this one. Oh Anything to look like you. Oh well, my gosh. we are fortunate enough to be here at the lovely Plaid Studios right across the street from World of Wonder, where they film and produce RuPaul's Drag Race. You might have Literally heard of it. It's won a few awards. Show. Yeah. This is like the Mecca. So I hope you guys shaved your beards because we're about to turn you into drag queens. Oh, oh my God. God. Oh gosh. I actually did just shave my beard. So this is actually <laughs> really great. Today, yes. um, you, as lovely as this beat is, we're gonna make take it a little more from day to night. Ooh. Yeah. Makeup for real women is light and beautiful. And but makeup for drag queens, you gotta cover this all up <laughs> and you gotta paint it all on. And so it's gonna be an 800 watt spotlight bulb on your face it without is going to be any electricity. Dramatic. Yeah. So uh. one of the first things that we're gonna do, mm. taking your eyebrows completely off. Oh, okay. are we shaving them or? I will let you in on a secret. There's not a ton there because they're microbladed. Oh, so you won't fierce. have to do as much. Work. Oh, look at that. Well, one of the tricks that drag queens use is glue stick. Yes, bitches, the same glue stick that you had to get when you were a kid in elementary school. That's oh, like Emerald's, or what's it called? Uh, El Elmer's Elmer? glue yeah. stick. We tried it. We tried this for a cost, like a like a special effects makeup tutorial one time. It yeah. didn't go very well. Oh, well, well, also we, to... we did it. So. I also <laughs> don't think this is already much more glue than I used that time. So. Wait, so, so what is this on wrong. my face? Yes, it's a pros aid. What is you that? can use it. Uh, it's a professional's aid. Prosade is basically like, Prosade is pretty much like eyelash glue on steroids. Oh. Right. And it keeps your brows down so that we can recreate your space. So how long does it take to become a pro at this? Like, is this just a natural talent you were born with? I've, oh yeah, I came out of the womb with lashes on. <laughs> and a rainbow flag, my mom knew something was up. <laughs> and I am still learning how to do makeup, to be honest. Really? Lovely, me too. Yeah, every, every day I learn a new little trick. Okay, so tell me about Mariah. Oh, well, she's... Mariah. Mariah's a bitch. Mariah. <laughs> Love her already. Mariah lost season three of Drag Race. <laughs> Manila Luzon also lost RuPaul's Drag Race season three. So. Oh, but uh, Mariah um, tends to be more of a uh, sensual, seductive. Ooh, sensual. Yeah. You have to teach me, like, some tips. Well, How I... sensual? Just the tip. Just, <laughs> just the, the tip. tip. Well, how did you guys come up with your names? Well, I was... <laughs> somebody gave me the name because it has the same amount of letters as my boy name, and they thought I was ditzy, and they were like, we need something that you'll be able to remember. <laughs> I was like, okay, we'll go with that. So they were like, Mariah, and if you want to find out my boy name that it rhymes with, you gotta Google me and like me on Facebook. I love that marketing tactic. <laughs> Choosing a name when you're in drag is very important because that's the name that uh, they announce before you hit the stage. Yes. So you don't want to have like a boring name like Jean. <laughs> Betty. Bring it to the stage, Miss 
Jane. <laughs> so we were trying to come up with some names, and we were like, even you had a good one. What was? Um, so I, I asked thought... if there was a formula, like if it's like a street name. Oh no, that's that that's a, that's a that's porn, porn star name. Different, much different. But if that was it, Jocelyn would be. Cinnamon Maple Dale. <laughs> oh, what was hers? Hers was really good too. Yeah. That would be Bootsy Wild Sage. Actually, you know what? That actually, the both of those work. Yeah. I'm both like, of those totally work. Why is them coming up with their name more interesting and entertaining than mine? Yeah, uh, both of them, yeah. Yours was like, oh, someone gave it to me. Right. Oh my like, gosh, what is RuPaul like? Uh, amazing. Such a majestic Such an energy. Such icon. Well, it's such a unicorn. Like, he's truly. The first, I, a lot of people don't believe this story when I tell it, but out of the sea foam came the first <laughs> unicorn dropping, and that was RuPaul. <laughs> it was in a clamshell. <laughs> out, out of the sea foam. It was no pearl. <laughs> Just a dropping. <laughs> Just a dropping. <laughs> She's awesome, her energy. She's always been such a good mentor to me. Uh, when we're filming World Wonder stuff um, at, in the studio, across the street from Plaid Studios. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard that DragCon is May 11th to 13th at oh the LA God. Convention Center in the I, South Hall? I did know that, Jocelyn, so because good. I believe you queens and we will all be there. Yay. Yay. So this is our run through. This is our first run through. And you guys, there's a link in the description if you want to buy tickets right now. Wow. And you do. That's the answer. It's and yes. So who are you like inspired <coughs> by? Felicia Rashad, like oh, the oh Cosby gosh, mom. Like yes. I loved her because she was so funny. She was so funny to me, She's also but like sassy. I love and it. stern. But and she would never raise her voice. But you knew exactly. Mm -hmm when she meant business, like and scary. I love that. Women are some of the most beautiful creatures in the entire universe. They have so much power, and they, a lot of times they don't even know it, which, which makes them even more which makes them even more beautiful. This is a work of art. You gotta sit real still for this. Mm -hmm, yeah. So I feel like it comes up that we have several viewers that want to be drag queens. How does one get into the drag community? You just do it. I love you go that. For it. Yeah, the thing about drag is it's really fun because you can do anything you want. There's no rules. There's no right way. It's just like, just drag is just dive into it. But like, how did you guys get your start? Um, I started putting on my mother's makeup and my mother's clothes that she left in my closet because my mother had so many clothes that she <laughs> put it in my closet, which was the <laughs> biggest mistake she ever made. But like, when does it transition from like doing it in your house to like doing Pro. it? Yeah. I started out doing um, amateur drag competitions. At, the, at my local gay bar. I started okay. out doing the ballroom scene, which is the birthplace of Vogue. Oh my gosh. So what, what's going on over here on my face right mm -hmm. now? Now we're doing the highlight under your extremely exaggerated eyebrows. Great. <laughs> her eyebrows are so exaggerated, they actually go into her hairline. <laughs> they literally do. Okay, this is my favorite part of, the, of doing drag, because this is the part where you mess up. Mm -hmm. The most, okay. The yeah, because lash. it doesn't matter how flawless your makeup is. If you put on one of these lashes a, a little bit crooked, you look like Gia messed Gia. up. These bitches look prettier than me. I'm over <laughs> this, okay? Y'all look too. See, mm -hmm. if, if I was born a biological woman and I put all this makeup on, I would be so damn beautiful. You oh, are, I'd be, though. I'd be a oh bitch. I'd be a straight up bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Can't handle that. If this video gets 125,000 likes, is that good? Is that nice? yeah. 125,000 likes. Good number. Sound guy has to get turned into a drag queen. Yes, 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 yes. I'm here for it. Do you yeah. agree? Do you agree? Yeah. Oh my gosh. We have verbal confirmation. Oh, pretty. All right. 125,000 likes. 125,000 likes. I think this the is job is yours, content. you guys. Okay, cool. Sure. Sure, sounds great. Yeah, you'll get Perfect. lots of cream hey, after I, I, for sure. I got a nutty cone. Oh my god. Like this like video, video right now. <laughs> Some guy up here is gonna get creamed in his face. <laughs> but, with makeup. But, with, with makeup. makeup. <laughs> Final touches. Mm -hmm. Now it's time to get your outfits on. Mm, so okay, excited. Are you ready? Mm. Yes. Boot Don't look at yourselves. Okay. Don't look at yourselves. Okay. No, no peeking. In the mirror. Back no to the mirror, Chloe. No peeking. Do your ears feel like they're gonna fall off? They do, but I think that's a good sign, yes. right? Is Sick. that a good yes. sign? All right, the yeah. wigs, girls. Oh, is the that yellow wig. to match my boa? Wig Gate 2018. Oh, okay. Wow, I have goosebumps. All oh, right. <gasps> Excuse me. <laughs> we need a little bit of hair. Oh, yeah. Veronica Lake, who? Who's? I don't know that name. 
I don't know her. I don't know her. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Bootsy Wild Saint. Oh, Bootsy. Pleasure to meet you. Call me Cinnamon. Cinnamon. Mapledale. <laughs> oh, cinnamon maple tail. Oh, wow. Oh, yes, of the oh, Connecticut maple tail. Obviously, tri state region. Connecticut. Mariah, are you ready to show these bitches what they look like? Girl, I'm ready. I don't think that they're ready. Mm -hmm. Okay, girls. One, two, three. Oh, my God. I look what is so going good. On? I do Say look like it? someone. This is share, bitch. Oh, I'm gonna cry. You can't even see my forehead wrinkles. I'm so happy. Don't I kind of look like Who I would be like Botox? a ghost on like a cruise ship? That, like everyone died I and then they all got so stuck. Awesome. <laughs> but you know, there's only one thing left we have to do. What is that? It's prune, of course. What's prune? Oh, the well, the Aussie prune. twins uh, started it on the red carpet to get their perfect pout. All the poo. Yes, so now we do it to reveal all of our grandest looks. Oh, so well, this, this is, is a grand, a grand look. This is the grandest, 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 grandest prune right okay. now. Yes. Honestly, we barely fit in this car with these amazing wigs There's on. truly not enough headroom. They really should have planned for uh, drag queens to be driving these cars. This is seriously, I know we get to do cool stuff all the time, <laughs> but this is like so far, like surpassed my expectations. I don't know what to do. I honestly. think that it's around here, people just aren't necessarily used to seeing it like just out and about. But guess what guys, if you want to see it out and about, go to DragCon because it's like this everywhere. This has just been such a fun experience and I feel so sassy. Huge shout out to Mariah and Manila, our oh, queens. Such uh, queens. Literally and figuratively, uh, we are now royalty, just like the clue said. 100% follow them on socials and keep watching this show so we can keep living our freaking dream. Also subscribe, because that would be cool too. Exactly. Until next time, I think we should leave them with a prune. Oh yes, one, two, three. Prune. It's so funny because I was going to say that right before oh, we said we're that. So I know, so Great insane. Great yeah. oh. Bye. Bye. <laughs> click to the left to see us making custom jean jackets on Beauty Trippin' and click to the right to see our DIY at Home Spa on Beauty Break.